you regain consciousness at the scene of a crash. Totally stunned. Your plane has crashed into a hospital and you're the sole survivor. Well, not exactly. You were traveling with your partner, Sophia, but she seems to have disappeared. You must find her. Heads up, you're blocked by four zombies. On the ground are a few different objects, some of which must have fallen from the plane. There's an iron bar, the body of a zombie, a lighter, and a flare gun with a cartridge. Which could you use as a weapon to get past the four zombies? You're stunned, and you don't have much time to think. Now's when you find out if you're the kind of person who can make a quick decision, and if you've got good survival instincts. You've just regained consciousness, and you're stunned. You don't have the strength to fight off zombies with an iron bar. The lighter won't be much use. The zombies will eat you before you can light them on fire. And the flare gun isn't a weapon to kill, but just a tool to alert others in case of emergency. Your only real option here is the dead zombie. Cover yourself with zombie pieces, organs and all. That way the zombies won't smell your living flesh. Anyone who watches zombie shows knows that one. You're starting to get your strength back. You see another person fighting a zombie. You have a choice. Take the door in the back, which leads to a stairwell and the floor above. But fire is raging through that floor and could reach the door at any moment. Should you save the other person or run for the door? This other person could have crucial information for you, but if you stop to help them, you might never reach the other door, which could at any moment be consumed by flames. You save the other person. They're also in ripped and torn clothes. Another crash survivor. Thank you. I think I saw your partner dressed as a maid. If you follow me, I can bring you to her this way. You arrive in a room where you find Sophia. I thought you were a goner. What's going on? The other survivor has locked you into the room. Why would they do that? You save someone from zombies and this is the thanks you get? Never help people. Maybe Sophia's been onto something all this time. They did it because Sophia was bitten by a zombie. That's why there's a bite mark on her arm. They've gained some extra getaway time by leaving you behind as a first meal. So now you find yourself trapped with your partner in this room. And at any moment, she could transform into a zombie. What would you do in this situation? As if things aren't hard enough, Here's a bonus riddle for people that like to add challenge to misery. If you share me, you commit treason and an outrage. As I spread, I cease to exist. What am I? Give us your answer and share your own favorite riddles. And make sure to click the red button and subscribe to our Riddle Me This channel. Riddle!